just kind of over it right now. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am talking about why I stopped using scripting to manifest. I'm gonna be honest, I don't remember the last time I scripted. And if I did script, I was kinda half doing it, like I wasn't really into it. So that is what we're gonna talk about today. I have my wine glass with water because it just makes me feel fancy, so I'll be sipping on my water. So we are just gonna chat today and I'm just going to give y'all the real on what's been happening with me and manifesting and scripting and I'm just kind of over it right now and I'll just tell you why. So I stopped scripting for a couple of reasons. I would say the main reason that I stopped scripting to manifest is I've been burnt out y'all. Burnt out of just scripting and manifesting, more so writing when it comes to manifesting and scripting is a part of that. I cannot script every single day. If you are that person that can script every single day, good for you. Me, I just can't do it. I feel like with scripting, there's so much that goes into it that it just takes a lot of energy out of you. If you haven't checked out my scripting videos, check them out, but scripting is a way to manifest and it's like writing a story. So let's say you are writing a book or writing a play or something. I think of scripting kind of like that. I can't write the exact same thing every day or I can't write something different every day because when I sit and script, I need to be inspired. I need to really want something. I need to create a story and be kind of creative sometimes. I don't feel like I can do that every single day. And I think that's gonna be probably my recommendation going forward. Also, when you script, you want your feelings and your emotions to be into it. I've noticed with like some scripts probably recently, like I'll just do it just to do it and not really feel it. I don't want to manifest in script that way. I don't want to just be writing something, not really feeling it. Because when I script, I try and do like a page or something. I don't really like short scripts that much. Sometimes I'll do it. If I did script something within probably the last few months, I didn't feel like my, my energy was high. I felt like I was just writing something because I needed to script or I haven't scripted in a while or trying it again. So I'm not sure if this is the end of my scripting journey for a while, but I haven't really been wanting to write anything, which could be related to some other things that I'm gonna talk about, but that is the number one reason that I just stopped using scripting to manifest. Another reason that I stopped using scripting to manifest is I've just been tired of writing, period. like. I don't know if this is just the season of just being tired of writing in my manifestation journal, but I haven't been writing in it that much. I've been leaning more towards affirmations and even those I feel like I'm kind of half doing too or like my feelings aren't really in it. I'm thinking maybe I need to take a break from it or maybe I need to try other manifestation methods but just writing isn't something I've been wanting to do lately. Maybe I've been doing it too much. Like if I write every single day in my manifestation journal, maybe that's just becoming overwhelming for me. Now I'm seeing that I'm trying to like force myself to write. Like, oh, let me just write some affirmations or something to feel like I'm manifesting something intentionally. And I don't really wanna do that. I really wanna feel it and be in the moment. I'm just navigating that right now in my life, but at the same time, not trying to put too much pressure on myself because that's not good. One thing I feel like I always tell you all is to do what feels right. Do what feels good. That is what you want to use to guide you. You don't want to force anything. Everything should feel easy and natural. And if it doesn't feel like that, maybe you need to take a step back. Maybe you need to take a break. Maybe you need to try something else. So yeah, I just, I fell off. I, I stopped using my manifestation journal as much lately which I think is related to all the reasons I just told you. Most important thing is the emotion. Yes, you can write it and all of that, but your emotion has to be attached to it. You have to really desire it. 
you have to really feel it you have to really want it because you can't just write it all the time i understand if you have some off days where maybe you just want to write something down which i've done before but if it becomes a habit and it's not something you want to continue to do i think the final reason that i stopped scripting to manifest is because i've really just been enjoying where i am right now in life and all of my manifestations that have come true so far like i've literally just been enjoying it all and just in awe of of it all and being grateful for it all and just content truly appreciating it by doing that that made me not want to look at the next thing because it's like oh i have so much already i haven't been focused on the next thing that much or what else do i want i've really just been relaxing chilling enjoying myself and it has been amazing just being in it just being here right now in this moment basically you know when people say you're you're living your prayers you know i'm living that i'm living my manifestations right now and i'm just wow um but yeah i'm just in a good place in life so manifesting here or there not really writing it that much but you know manifesting in other ways but i am ready to start back intentionally manifesting i'm ready to start back using my manifestation journal i'm ready to start back scripting and just finding my way because i put a lot of things on hold and i realized i'm ready to make other moves in my life now and i know i need to manifest and script that and also work towards it so i'm at that point where it's like okay i think i chilled enough I've enjoyed it enough. I am ready to manifest other things. I'm ready for, you know, the next level. I'm ready to keep practicing and seeing what else I can manifest. So that's where I am right now in my manifestation journey. So y'all, yeah, that is the end of this video about why I stopped using scripting to manifest but basically i think it's a short-term thing i don't think it's gonna last forever i think i'm in that season right now where maybe i need to do something different maybe this is just a break i'm not sure but i've been going with my feelings and that is what i want you to do when it comes to manifesting well that's the end of my video if you enjoyed this video and you found value in it hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video